Look, trouble's here. It's not me. I'm, I'm known usually as trouble, but my wife's here. She's double trouble. She came by on the bike. And uh, if you guys are praying, folk, pray for her. She's going into a trip to Montana, off in the distance on that bike. So if you guys pray, pray for my wife's safety, okay? She's been gone for a week. Actually, pray for me because I'm going to have my kids. <laughs> All right, so what we're doing is uh, my wife and I are going out in one last road trip on, in Tim's 1973 Mach 1. I have not gotten her to break down. I can't do it, Tim. I can't do it. I've driven her hard. I've had fun. People are giving me thumbs up. The whole nine yards. I'm using her for lunch breaks so I can drive her. Oh, and here comes the exhaust system for Peter's car. I see him coming around. Here it comes. I got to do another video. But anyway, we're taking your car out. You're an expensive doorman. Now, of course, what do I do? Like every good man, I wait for my wife. Are you comfortable? Does this know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of when you were out in a car similar to this doing the power brake incident. I taught I taught I taught her how to do power braking. Isn't she beautiful, guys? Isn't she beautiful? She said she's like, she's I gotta get a professional photographer to take my glory years pictures. I'm like, you're always on video. <laughs> Didn't work. We still have to hire some kind of professional photographer to catch the beauty that she has right now. <laughs> but here it is now. You guys can write, enjoy it. All right, so um, we're gonna drive around your car. I'm not gonna make a lot of videos like I do with Bobby back and forth because we'll get on her nerves. But I'll, as I'm driving back, I'll call, I assume, with a good report because I'm 99.9% .9 sure that this car is not gonna break down on you, Tim. I always leave that little percent there because there's a lot of moving parts. <laughs> That's what my lawyer suggested I say. All right, it's a hot day and she's running cool. All right, Tim, I got my wife right here. She's been driving in the car with me up until lunch. Is it running well, Sessie? Yes. Okay, there's another witness that she's running well without stalling in your car. <laughs> I get a little too paranoid. My wife would agree. Yeah, well, it is what it is. It is what it is, baby? It is what it is. All right, driving back to the shop in style taking it easier over the speed bumps. All right, well this concludes the longest documentary of a test drive in a car. To prove that she does run without issue. Just having fun with you on the video. Said something. But no, she's good. She's good, she's good, she's good. I hope you guys aren't bored with these test drives. But that's it. Four days of test drives, no issues with no air conditioning, with the new Protronics, running good, running hard, running strong, getting lots of looks. Check! Test drive three. She's good to go. And she's going to be ready and clean for you tomorrow at pickup. And then she'll be back for the air conditioning. We got it from, uh, well, I'll show you the company we got it from when we go to install the new compressor and dryer. Happiness is. Yeah. All right, now what's this about? Taylor Dino from Minnesota. A heavily disguised car. Three of them. They're doing some kind of testing on a car and they're acting all nonchalant. He's smiling. <laughs> they're doing something special here from Minnesota. He's got his computer. He's looking at. <laughs> 
He's smiling, and I don't know what that is. And that's a right-hand drive car. And that's a Taylor Dyno. Pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. I have to add one thing to this, uh, this road testing. It's very hot. I mean, I'm sweating. There's no air conditioning in this car. Um, and she's running cool, Tim. She's a cool runner. There's no issues with this 351 uh, Cleveland two-barrel, two Venturi. Um, we often have problems with 289s. Guys, any 289 that's bored out after 30 over is going to run hot. It just is. It's the nature of the beast. So we're always struggling to keep 289s cool in this environment. But uh, th very rarely do we have issues with 351s, and this is another case of a cool running, uh, well running car. All right, that's the end of the videos for Tim's car. He'll take her tomorrow. We'll see her next week. I'm back to the shop. Oh, I'm following a Mustang. I'm gonna see where they're going.